Her home flooded four times in the last five years, and tonight there's some relief for one woman and others who live along the coast. The city of New Smyrna Beach taking action to fight rising sea levels. It is raising homes at risk of flooding. News 6's Jerry Askin has a look at the project and how it is getting results. You can see the temporary fixtures. These are going to be placed throughout the whole house. It's a big lift and a big relief for Amanda Prokup. Her family has dealt with flooding in their homes four times in the past five years. But now, their waterfront property is one of nine homes in flood-prone areas in New Smyrna Beach being elevated by eight feet. You're saying this is your dream home. You're in paradise. Paradise. Why do you stay there? Paradise in the backyard. Because you can't beat this. You can't find this anywhere. Here's how the inside of her home looked after Hurricane Ian, the historic storm pushing rain and water from behind her home inside. Most of her furniture destroyed, and her hallways looked more like a river. Procup says during Hurricane Ian, the water got as high as four feet inside of her home. She lost everything, and that's why getting her home elevated right now means the world to her. The project is all thanks to a federal grant called the Hazard Mitigation Grant Program, where FEMA will pay for 75% of the elevation, with the remaining cost being split between the city of New Smyrna Beach and the homeowner. For Procup, it's about 70,000 bucks out of pocket. Well, it's cheaper than repetitively flooding, so yeah. yeah, we'll find a way to make it work. I'm excited to see this happen. It's been five years for me, and you know, I, I feel like I'm part of the you know, families putting these houses up. I'm just real excited. City engineer Kyle Fegley said construction is finally underway after nine homes were selected based on the recurrence of flooding and damages. And there will be another chance for others to try and get help. Volusia County will be holding a public meeting next Wednesday in Daytona Beach for future residents who want to apply for the grant. This is just such a relief to know that we're not going to flood again. Yeah. Well, hopefully not. No, well, if we flood again, <laughs> the whole state of Florida is underwater. So, <laughs> In New Smyrna Beach in Volusia County, I'm Jerry Askin, getting results, News 6.